AMD Ready's Radeon RX 7600 XT, RX 7700, and RX 7800. Even as Nvidia inches close to the launch of its RTX 40 series Super Graphics cards in January, AMD could be preparing a product stack update of its own. While Nvidia's refresh focuses on the higher end of its lineup, AMD looks to spread out more into the mainstream performance segments. A regulatory filing with the Eurasian Economic Commission mentions the terms RX 7600 XT, RX 7700, and RX 7800, which fill gaps between the RX 7600, RX 7700 XT, and RX 7800 XT. There exists a rather big gap between the $230 Radeon RX 7600 and the $450 RX 7700 XT, which AMD is looking to fill with the RX 7600 XT and RX 7700, non-XT. How AMD goes about carving out these two will be interesting to see. The RX 7600 already maxes out the 6 nanometers Navi 33 inches silicon that it's based on, which means to create the RX 7600 XT, AMD might have to tap into the larger, and much more expensive, Navi 32 inches MCM. There is a vast gap between the 32 CU, compute units, available to the RX 7600, and the 54 CU that the RX 7700 XT has, while the silicon itself has 60. Besides CU count, AMD has other levers, such as the MCD, memory cache die, count, which could be down to just 2 for the RX 7600 XT, or 3 for the RX 7700. The Radeon RX 7800 is a different beast. AMD faced quite some flack for positioning the RX 7700 XT within $50 of the RX 7800 XT, and now the former can be had for a street price of roughly $430. To be able to squeeze the RX 7800 between the two, AMD might need to widen the gap by pushing the RX 7700 XT down.